I really hate doing these videos. I mean, I like doing the videos, but I hate seeing myself. Anyway, what's up? It's Faith. So I'm doing a uh, diaper video um, because Tess and Lee had a great Pampers review. I'm definitely team Pampers and not team Huggies. And I have used Huggies because when Jaden was born, they gave me like a crap load of diapers at the hospital. Um, I had a lot of diapers, actually. I couldn't wait to get rid of them. Or not get rid of them. I, I definitely used them all. But um, I couldn't wait till the Huggies were finished because I had crazy blowouts, crazy leaks. Um, they were terrible for me. I'm definitely a team Pampers. And if you saw any of my videos, I had like 2,000 Pampers, you know, in the closet before he was even born. So um, I'm going to do a review on the size 3. It's the Baby Dry version of the Pampers. I use those because Jaden is bigger. And we'll move on to that. I use the Baby Dry diapers because Jaden is bigger. And the Baby Dry, which is great, this is the box. Um, they are good for up to 12 hours, and they really are good for up to 12 hours. Um, I normally don't like to leave Jaden in a diaper for too long, uh, especially when he was littler. I would definitely change his diaper while he was sleeping. But he sleeps sometimes 10 hours at a clip, and sometimes I sneak change his diaper, sometimes it wakes him up. But the one thing I do love about Pampers is they keep you dry. They keep the baby dry. So it's not like he's sitting in his wet diaper and he's getting diaper rash. Jaden has never had diaper rash. Every now and then I use some Desitin on um, the crack because sometimes it gets a little red. Um, I guess because it gets moist in there. But um, that's once a month, maybe, if that. Um, and I am a bulk buyer, so I buy a bunch of Pampers. I always have two cases unopened. Once a case gets cracked open, I get another one. I, I never want to run out of Pampers. And like I said, I, I'm a Pampers person. So this is the largest box that I particularly purchased. Jaden is a size 3 right now, but he's progressing to a size 4. He's right now 20 and a half pounds, and he's 21 uh, inches or 28 inches. 28, 29. I gotta take a look. He just went to the doctor the other day. He's so long, they thought it was a mistake. Um, so this is the largest size threes that I've ever found. Um, if you do know of any that you can buy more than 222, let me know because I love getting large amounts of diapers. Um, I, I um, again, going to the Pampers, this is what the Pampers size three looks like. Um, like, if you compare it to, to Huggies, um, it doesn't have a lot of stuffing in it, but again, it's very um, adjustable. Once I put it on, I, I stretch out these ruffles for him. Um, and again, it lasts a long time. With these, when they get this big, you'll hold Jaden in the background. Once the baby gets this big, you don't need the indicator to know that the baby's diaper's wet because it gets so fat and swollen like it's not even a problem. Um, and again, he drinks a lot. He eats a lot. These diapers never, ever had a problem. Um, so talking about where I purchased my Pampers diapers, I used to get them from diapers.com. I love that there's the pluses and minuses of diapers.com. For a size like the size 3 for 222 diapers, you would get them for $47.99. With diapers.com, you know, when you first become, like, start buying from them, you get, like, five cases, $5 off per case. Um, one time and then every and they do accept coupons and they have e-coupons so sometimes you can get them for forty seven ninety nine um, if you use the e-coupon so that comes out to like 20 cents a diaper but I now get them because I'm part of Amazon Prime and Amazon mom or whatever on Amazon um, where you can do what's called subscribe and save so you buy your pampers ahead of time you can have it set up to any frequency that you want you if you want them if you want a case of diapers once every two months once every three months once every month or two cases a month whatever you want you basically prepay them they they send them to you a week before your due date uh, of, you know, for when you schedule them. Say if you want your Pampers on the 15th of every month, they'll send them, like, on the 7th. Um, you know, they'll, they only charge a credit card that time when they send it. But, again, you save 20% off your diapers. So this case of diapers, I paid $37.75 uh, for my Pampers when normally you'll pay 49 to 47 anywhere else. Um, the shipping is free because I have the Amazon Prime. I end up having to pay for the subscription for Amazon Prime now, but I buy so much through Amazon, I definitely get the $80 back uh, for shipping for sure because I'm like an Amazon crackhead. Um, so you pay about $0.17 cents per diaper. So again, I get them Amazon, subscribe and save. You can get a case like this, 227, 222, 20, 
222 diapers for about $37.75. And again, there's free shipping and you get it the next day, if not the second day. Diapers.com is excellent with their shipping. Um, but again, I saved $10 per case because I'd simply subscribe and save. So you save more because you're kind of pre-ordering your diapers. Um, that also counts for the wipes and the diaper genie stuff. And you can even get huggies on that subscribe and save too. You don't have to just get Pampers. Um, but again, I'm definitely a team Pampers. I love Pampers. I've never had a problem with them. I'm 100% satisfied with Pampers. And I actually do enjoy the baby dry. Um, because again, he sleeps for 10 hours a stretch and I don't have to change that diaper and it will hold up during that time. Um, and again, he's not laying in wetness because the diapers do wick water away. And again, I totally love them. So if you are looking into it, I definitely highly recommend Pampers.